Greetings, everyone. I am Lotus Prince, and for this Let's Play, Mr. Ryu and I are going to tackle The Quarry. This is a new game in the Supermassive Games series. This isn't really part of a series, it's a standalone title, but Supermassive Games creates a lot of games like this, so I'm very excited to see the next one. I've played four of their games so far, and I've thoroughly enjoyed them. Here comes the fifth. We are in summer camp, and there's definitely a retro 80s vibe to this game, even though it seems to take place in the present day. It's kind of like how Until Dawn had schlock jump scare horror, like from the 70s, but it was present day for its time as well. But what makes this a little bit more, I don't know, of the era, is that we actually have some people we have seen in movies before, even of the time. So I'm quite excited to see some figures from my childhood, as well as a brand new story where I don't quite know where it's going. Can we survive the night? Well, there's only one way to find out. Let's go crazy. Oh my goodness, it's The Quarry. I'm excited. I damn too. You know what excites me most about this game? This might sound a little <clears throat> weird. It has Lance Henriksen in it. Do you remember who that is? I have no idea who that is, because like, if you give me names of actors, I'd be like, yeah. who is that? <laughs> You've seen him, but you might not. You, you didn't see Aliens, did you? No. There's a lot of movies I haven't seen. But, but you did see Pumpkinhead. He's the main guy. Oh. He's Ed Harley. He's a... He's a Horror actor from oh, the Oh, I like that loading. I like that loading. It's a VHS. a VHS. Oh my god. It's not it's not a spooky skull compass this time. Oh thank goodness, that was too scary. Two K. Yep. That's two K. Super massive baby. We're in it to win it. No, I, I like their names, so Yeah, they're so good. This one oh actually surprised me. Oh my god. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> no. And e even the font is like Friday the 13th. Right. You know what gets me though is like, this is both like a positive and a negative, but it gets me excited. Is that, you know how the Dark Pictures anthology games have all been like 40 bucks? Yeah. This one's back up to full price, like until dawn, which is weird, but I wonder if that means it's like a different kind of experience. Maybe it's a more longer game? Right? I mean, it, slightly longer? Maybe. It, it does have a star-studded cast, I believe. I mentioned Lance Henriksen, but there are others. Um, my God, I don't give a damn. I I guess I disagree. I disagree. All. I don't. I'm not going to read this, so I disagree. I think I'm obligated to agree to the uh, terms of service. Actually, I don't think anyone ever reads these anyways. <laughs> it does say transfer of your data. What What if I disagree? Can I just do that? Legal agreement required. That's fair enough. Well, I bought the game. <laughs> Oh, you bastards. Alright, I agree. Streamer mode. It replaces licensed music tracks with royalty free. Oh, actually, I get it. I get it, actually. That, that's, uh. Yeah, I, I feel awful about this because I'm gonna lose the authenticity, but I should do this. Because that's yeah, how they get yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like. I gotta say, I've never seen this in a game before. That's very considerate. Yeah, because, right, like, so I there's a lot of games where, like, it has, like, DRM music. Do you, do you it think just, that it's screwed? <laughs> I'm gonna have to play this game again off camera. Uh, do you think they're gonna have, um, if it's royalty free, do you think they're gonna have that Kevin McCloud track that, like, it's that weird ass name, that, like, Android Sock Hop or something? Do you remember, I, do you remember Fucker in the Woods, the menu theme? It's like, it's like that weird ass song. Oh my god, it takes me It's really awesome to play that. It's just playing that. <laughs> oh god, that'd be terrible. <laughs> Streamer mode. Oh, I can enable her to say little bit, please. That's good stuff. I'm actually very curious to hear what the uh, the licensed music is, but oh well. Uh, movie mode. Predefined out. Oh, that's cool. Oh, you can either play it as a game or just like watch it like a movie. That's cool. Well, that's great because that that honestly, this has been a complaint of mine since the PS2, like since Dark Cloud, where they had QTE events with really cool scenes playing, but you needed to QTE to get them, so I can't actually watch the cool stuff that's happening because I'm focusing so hard on the bottom. <laughs> but uh, then, like, it's like that... You get some funny QTEs, like the Spider-Man game QTE, where it's like, I'm funniest. going to die! <laughs> you, where you just flop on your face like an idiot? Yeah! Also, if you BAM, I'm gonna die! 
Uh, that was like Spider Man Three. That game was like I think for, oh, I think the game was pretty bad except for that opening part, which is the greatest thing in any game. <laughs> okay, what was Couch Co op though? Is it just like a I'm passive a, controller? I'm thing, assuming or? it's passive controller. I can still do that. But it's not instant interactive. It's not fun. It's it, a co op. It, it doesn't it's say couch, couch co op. <laughs> so how is it meant to be played? <laughs> God. <laughs> oh, should I David Arquette just immediately? Also, let me do one thing. I'm, I'm doing. I do this every single time. Every single time we start one of these games, I do this. <laughs> no, please don't interrupt the game with your own no, pause menu. No, but I, I do this every damn time. But really quick, subtitles on. Okay, yeah, actually, that that's actually some. Wait, why is there no option for that before you boot the game? There was there, and I missed it. Maybe I don't know. Uh, but yeah, yeah. With these kinds of games, I'll say you can easily miss dialogue. <laughs> yeah, very easily. Accessibility. Also, this was really good. Oh, simple now. QTs. That's cool. Choice timer. That's great. This is a whole lot of stuff we haven't gotten before. Don't breathe. Um, automatically succeed. Oh, well. But a lot, a lot of cool settings. This is good stuff. Oh, I think th it's probably from feedback from, uh, I guess, a bunch of people. I wonder, do you think it's like until dawn, don't breathe, like the hold the controller? And what I didn't, what I never realized at the time. Is that you could just put the controller on the floor and then you just win because you're not shaking the controller? No, 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 no. They they did something to circumvent that. The or controller, the, the controller vibrates. All right, all right. <laughs> They're like, nah, uh, uh. <laughs> All right, we're good. Back to the game. Also, Taro, I'm instantly pleased. Yeah, I th I think you, you did try that once. It was like, it's like uh, too damn it. <laughs> Evan Evagora, I don't recognize that name. That name is vaguely familiar. Yeah, I wonder what song this would be. With the... Hey, look, it's the best uh, person ever. Y you'll know when you see him. So this is the streamer. Right? Ted Raimi! I forgot about that. He's Sam Raimi's brother. Oh, wow. He just like shows up as little bit parts in some of his movies. I think he had a little more of a part in like Dark Man. Ted, that's freaking wild. Lin Shay, there we go. I don't know any of these people. I recognize a few of the names. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not great with names. Justice Smith. Man, it is dark out here. Read the songs. Ethan Suplee. Let's you play. I like. I, I'm. There's a, if if I don't like know someone's name, if I'm not very familiar, it's a good chance I'm gonna like butcher it and make a fool of myself. Yeah, I'm just like we get the name of this. Is that Tanker? Yeah, I know some of these names. Yeah, some I know. Who that is? He, he, yeah. Freaking Ted Raimi and Lance Henriksen, though. Goddamn. And the funny thing is, I'm not even like. Like like I haven't seen that many Lance Henriksen movies. I just freaking love the guy. <laughs> He was in all four Pumpkinhead movies. He just he shows up as the ghost, like, don't make the mistake I did in the, in the sequels. <laughs> Here we go. We have begun. We are Laura. Why'd you kill the music? I think you know why. Um, <laughs> I don't think I do. It begins with an L? Like the L word? Lesbians? <laughs> Scott, Scott Pilgrim lost. reference? <laughs> We're in geographic flux. Right, so... lost. That's debatable. Scott Pilgrim references the 80s, but referencing Scott Pilgrim is not... They're just wow. outright telling me? That's... Fallout? What? <laughs> I should wait, this is great. <laughs> Take a moment to consider the following, as it will guide you through the various twists and turns that may appear during your stay at Hackett's Quarry. What you see here, was I actually supposed time to time press that? Time. I don't know actually. I think it's just a uh, dream. You to act at just the right time. You know, this, this is actually a great QT introduction. Step. Yeah, this is just Fallout. Maggot's quarry can be a dangerous place if you're not paying attention to your surroundings. Take oh no. Your eye off the ball, and it could spell disaster. The path <laughs> Oh, what the hell? I thought dumb. Oh my god. <laughs> <obstacles> <laughs> it's huge. <laughs> Oh, this is great, the static. Oh, Channel 1, though, was that ever a thing? 
up. Oh, analog up. Nice catch there. Huh? That's what that was. I'm not the one. I thought it was supposed to be a circle because it was like closing in on it. I think that's the well, analog stick. Like, oh, Never think about that. Wow. No, I'll that do is it right like next Olympic time. level goalpost moving. Thank yeah, you. it does Very look like a circle. Thank you. Yeah. Still totally lost. You know what, Max? It's okay. It doesn't make you any less of a man. You know, if Columbus hadn't gotten lost and landed on these golden shores, there would be no United States of America. <laughs> Goodbye, hot dogs. See you later, apple pie. Columbus never actually landed in North America. It was Caribbean, wasn't it? What are you talking about? Didn't even know he wasn't in Asia. Are you serious? Well, yeah, that's why no, they're called Indians. He thought he was in India. Want... <laughs> was well, just another guy who's got a whole day named after him, so... Put that in your pipe and smoke it. Oh my god. Okay, just get us to camp already before I roll my eyes out of my head, please. <laughs> I'm working on it. I'm working on it. America was named after Amerigo Vespucci. Really? Yeah. I had no idea. His first name. <laughs> oh, leaflet or map? Map. Oh, uh, okay, left stick. Left stick. Or, or both? I don't know. <laughs> Whatever. I use both. What is that? You gotta get used to this. Yeah, yeah. No, but seriously, what will happen to the, the normal map? This is the normal map. The one on the phone. What? No bars. Oh, the, I, I thought this was actually in the 80s. I guess it's not. It's just 80s retro. Let's see, so we are... So making a Scott Pilgrim reference does make sense. This uh -huh. is not actually 1980-something. It's on maps. Have you yeah, seen any signs like, for it? They, they, they had, like, a... They zoomed into the uh, phone with the... Uh, hey, eyes on the oh, road! Oh, you're right. Whoa. What is that? Is it a wolf? I think it's an animal. Because like I, I noticed when it said like auto automatic don't Oh, in the car? Okay, okay, you're right. But uh, like I noticed when it said automatic succeed, it said except for wolf pack or something. So could we have actually lost the character right there because that death woman was in the back? Maybe? Just we'd like start the game and just die. <laughs> <laughs> or like kind of messed up. He would have died. She wouldn't have. Yeah, yeah. I mean, still in one piece. Jesus Christ. One piece. The treasure. A bear. I left all of my. Tre what? No, no, Max. It wasn't a bear. What was it? You know, it was a person. I don't think it was a person. Do you think we had a person? I don't know. I mean, it was really cl close, like really close, but maybe we didn't. Getting out of the car in the middle of the night. Here he comes. What is it? I really have this car up. Yeah. Yeah. Well, maybe it looks worse than it is. Uh, I should check out the damage before we try to start it up again, huh? Could you grab my, uh, the, the toolbox from the trunk? Yeah, yeah. Okay. When I saw the hyphen, can you grab my, uh, I thought he was going to get grabbed because it cut him off. I was getting nervous when I see text like that. That's a bit too early right now. <laughs> no, maybe, but when I see text prompts like that where it just ends with a hyphen, I'm like, mm. Oh, oh and play. we're playing. We're playing. Oh, that's actually very helpful. The way they to get the... It really is. It's not so bad. My mom's gonna kill me. The important thing is that we survived. Uh, yep. Okay, go somewhere else. My walk speed isn't bad. Do you think I could press L1 to faster? Oh, I can. <laughs> I think I can. Press L1 to faster. Yeah, I think you do press L1 to faster. Oh, that's, that's nice. I think, like, the, the issue with some of the other games is, like, you can't really fast through. I, well, the, well, you generally could. It was House of Ashes where you couldn't. Uh... B oh. By the way, speaking of House of Ashes and the Dark Pictures games... They went less and less with the pure schlock jump scares. But this is an 80s slasher movie? We might be back to Until Dawn levels of, like, utterly bullshit jump scares. So well, get ready. <laughs> I think that's that's the fun of it. It, 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 <laughs> it is, is the fun 100%. of it. That, that is the fun of it. But get ready. Like, just everything's going to jump out at us. No, there's something thrilling about jump scares in these kinds of things. It's just like, ah! <laughs> it's funny, because normally... Oh, tutorial. Because normally I hate this stuff, but like when the game is schlock 70s, 80s slasher, like, alright, 
So interrupts. Oh my god. At certain times throughout the night, opportunities will present themselves. Who is talking? Giving you the chance to take matters into your own hands. Oh, I see. It is worth noting that they are only suggestions. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, so you know you there's going to be one or two of these in the game where you really don't want to mess around. In fact, sometimes it's better not to. I love her every time something bad happens to her. She just has that, like, oh, come on, like that look. <laughs> and, uh, co combat. Am I even allowed to? I can't even look at it. Oh, I think the drugs is highlighted. It unlocks, yeah, it unlocks. Yeah. Like, this uh, is kind of amazing. So I'm going to come across an interrupt soon, presumably. Oh, it's there. Yeah, here we go. Do I? No, this is your place. Okay. Yeah, let's try it. Hopefully, I don't get caught. Oh yeah! Oh yeah! <laughs> Max Brinley rejected from Landis Unit. Oof! Should I recognize? Why didn't you tell me? Landis, I guess the director, John or Max Landis. I get. I, I think it's. Also, I did not have time to read that. By the way, that was just automatic. But yeah, it's just it's just his uh, application. Yeah, it sucks. Yeah. It's like, oof. Do you need a hand? Yeah, actually, if you could just shine a light right. Oh, here. you are accepted into Romero University. <laughs> Perfect. Thank you. The sooner we get out of here, the better. Just picture yourself curling up in front of a big old fire pit, singing campfire sing-alongs. I don't think people curl up right in front of big old fire pits. Why not? You know, fireplace. Uh, they don't want to catch on fire. Then, oh no, monster vision. But it's not weird vision, it's person vision, I bet. Well, I mean, it could be animal vision, here. it could be deer. I don't know. They wouldn't be stalking us. I think this is just the same area. There's something ah. there. It, 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 uh, is it different? Uh, oh, here it comes. Oh, that's creepy. I'm not controlling the flashlight, by the way. Where are you going? Just over here. I would really Just not. Stay there for a second, okay? I'm almost done. I th I I'll, I will stay. <laughs> I'm, I'm not going in there. God, Max, hurry up. What's I'm not on? going in there. <laughs> I'm worried that there's somebody down there. Are you serious? Yeah, I, they could be hurt. I don't know. I didn't think we actually hit anyone. Well, I don't know. I just, I heard something, okay? Like a, a woman. Do you think we hit her? I just want to check it out. I did okay. not her. <laughs> oh, hi, Max. Don't go too far. Okay? <laughs> oh, hi, Max. Yeah. Oh, no. Do, do not give me control. No. Oh yeah, just be ready for QTEs. I I know it's so easy to get caught up. Oh, what a fun movie! Then I just die. Okay. <laughs> Luck with the car. Yeah, I'm kind of curious about the movie though. Like, what's the actual like canonical yes? <laughs> yeah, who knows? Unless it's purposefully like not the best ending, because like play the game to get the best ending. That 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 seems like a retro thing to do though. I mean. Okay, I, I do get to put a passive touch light. Wee. No, but this is good though, because if there's a clue, if it's like other games, then I can just highlight it from here and not walk into my death. Look at this place. This sucks. It's not as bad as Little Hope, where you're on Silent Hill streets, but this is pretty bad. Mm. This music. Again, I gotta play this game again with with the licensed tracks. Just hear what that is. Oh, hello. I'm sorry. This 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 the song kind of reminds me of like a little weird news. Like, <laughs> yeah, when you're on Big Shell. <laughs> yeah. Harem Scarum sideshow spectacular. Wait, is this spooky like circus ghosts? Only one to find out. What's this? What's this? Harem Scarum poster. Um, this is a poster for a traveling sideshow. It looks like it's been here a while my glare is cutting that word off left forgotten in the woods are those burn marks around the edges oh this is interesting so there's they're just telling you categories of clues we're not doing that giant screen of like 40 clues and like which ones did you get you figure it out 
So uh, it's, it's a list format. Mm. Less visually exciting, but more convenient. Also, like, I took a whole menu for that. I didn't look at it in-game, which is interesting. I guess if you're a completionist. I got the clue. Keep playing. Man, this is creepy. Good thing it's a weirdly linear path. <laughs> like a video game or something. Yeah, I know, I know. <laughs> In real life, everything would be flat and there's just trees everywhere, but nope, I can't go past that wall to my left. <laughs> I wish things were that easy. Oh, hello. That looks like a dead end. Wait, what is that? Yeah, yeah, there's, there's a clue. Is that a coffin? Or is that just a I think it's bag? just a box. I think it's a box. It's a, oh, it's, it's a just like suitcase a, luggage? Please tell me it's like a magician's, like... Okay. Nope. Oh, no, it is! Oh. Escapology! Oh my god! We got an old-timey magician. A trunk filled with strange devices. That of an escapologist. Perhaps... My damn flashlight, I cannot read it. Perhaps... Perhaps just, just a... Perhaps a relic of a traveling show that must have passed through the area. I'm a little nervous. I hate when it just lingers on the character, like something's gonna happen, and then nothing happens. <laughs> it gets me in the, the spooky mood. By the way, can I just wait? Am I holding an actual flashlight, or am I still using my phone? No, this is my phone. This <laughs> you is a... using... Have you not noticed this? you're using your phone the whole time? No, I know I was using a phone, but I was gonna point out this is a really good flashlight. Oh, actually, like, no, no, for no, a no. phone. Phone flashlights are really good. <laughs> I guess so. Yeah, yeah. This is yeah, I've, very I've, impressive. I, I, I've used mine a couple times. They're, they're pretty I, nice. Do I go right or do I go forward? Uh, you know what? I think things will be all right <laughs> if you go right. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Oh, you chose correctly. Yeah, that was the right way. <laughs> oh no, it's the baker's house from Science Seven. Show Act. Science? Yeah. Oh, and you heard someone calling for Silas. So perhaps that wolf we almost hit was a freak in a freak show. But this is modern times. We don't do circus freak shows. So is it a ghost? Like, who does freak shows? This isn't like the 40s. <laughs> See, Silas, the dog boy. Uh, broken cage. This Actually, just... that, that would be looked at on a fight today. <laughs> just like, a little really bit. Hard. Yeah. Really hard. Just a little bit. <laughs> this decrepit cage has been engulfed by the woods over time. It... Looks like an animal has nested here. But there's a question mark below it. Oh, like, you can highlight it up there? Oh, that's... that's I, did, I didn't even realize that, but like, can I further investigate this I or guess what? you can. Try, try looking at it again. Oh, wait. Yeah, I can't control this. Yikes. This is too weird. Get that, like, spooky freak show music. And why am I doing this anyway? Like, I was looking for the woman. She's not here. Can we just go back, please? Like, how far into the woods oh, do you need oh, to go? Inspect it again. Oh, in case there's anything new? Oh, okay. I can look... Yeah, maybe we can do the zoom thing, like in previous games. I appreciate the light highlighting the relevant areas. X for text? Something as the dog boy, but we know. Okay, done, I guess. They really had me walk away from that for investigating it twice. Whoa. That was weird, but <laughs> alright. I'm just gonna guess it's a map transition or something. Whoa! Do I go back? Mm, I think it's gonna egg you on to go forward. Yeah, alright. Go towards this, the, toward the screen? Camera, yeah, towards the screen. Music's picking up a little bit. Wow. This, this is the best I got, yeah. We're, we're moving on. Now, for a dark game, I can see pretty well. Yeah, I'm surprised by the clarity. Yeah, normally this hard game is like in these portions, you just can't see anything. Yeah, you can see what you need to see. Oh, look, we're getting scary tree branches. They're all... 
Well, they're not getting gnarled, but they're they're not straight like usual. Oof, the way the camera really pulls in behind me as I move forward. Even though I'm in the woods and feeling a little across the throwback. Look, again, look at how far in the woods we're going. This is wildly unsafe. Like, forgetting the ghosts. Like, this is a, like no animals here at all. This is a terrible idea. That said, do you know how far into the woods we can go? Don't know. Halfway, because then we're going out. <laughs> I'm, I'm leaving right now. <laughs> I think I'm done. <laughs> also, yikes, get ready. Yikes. Get ready for our first proper scare. Like zoinks. Zoinks. I hope the ghost is bamboozled by our modern technology. How can you cast that light? <laughs> oh my god. You're telling me that's a phone? <laughs> <laughs> Get ready, we're gonna pan to the left and it'll... Hmm. I, did I miss something? I, I didn't see anything. Maybe we hear something, we're just panicking. It's like, there's nothing to see. But I promise you, we're gonna pan our light over Where something and be a face. The next? No, that's Silas? Question mark. Even though he's long dead. That's creepy. Oh. So it was the ghost. Do they know we're here? They're just fucking with us. I mean, what else does ghosts do? <laughs> that is a good point. If I were dead for f seventy years, eighty years, I'd probably troll too. QT. I keep getting fooled, like, press circle, but, like, no, it's setting me up to press down. At least that was, I don't know if diegetic is the right word. Oh, wait, this is exactly from the tutorial! <laughs> oh, that's clever. Do you think it, Do you think if she got bonked, she'd be like, ah, and nothing happens? Well, who says the direction? Like, holy shit. <laughs> Actually, yeah, that was amazing. There was noises all around me. Honey, honey, take a breath. It's okay. It's the woods. There's a lot of stuff out there. There's animals. It's easy to freak yourself out. No. Can we just leave? Please? Yeah, 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 yeah. Let's go. Okay. Did you fix the car? I think you did. Actually, the car might have still been drivable, just fucked up. Huh? Are you okay? Yes, there we go. Her and, like, you know what I just remembered? Yes, come on. Here we go, here we go. We're getting out of here. You die in the prologue of every one of these games. We'll see oh, this Oh, this, this is gonna be the prologue. Me. We're, we're gonna get killed. Just, okay, give me a minute. Give me That's a minute. why it didn't matter if I go, not avoided that first thing. Alright, enough! Shit, I'm sorry, honey. A little desync there. It's fine. It's okay, it's okay. You don't floor it, dude. You probably want to okay. press it lightly. We're safe in the car, really. We're gonna be okay. Oh, Jesus. Oh, fuck! Oh my god, my heart just exploded. Roll it down. Hi, officer. How are you doing this evening? Are either of you injured? Really, we're fine. We're just a little shaken up. This music. Mm. How did you find us? Actually, wait. Good question. I guess you we're not that far out of the woods. Or out of the road. Oh, oh, oh. Path chosen. Yes. <laughs> Packet's quarry is full of twists and turns, unknown paths, and unexplored wonders. With each step taken, you tread a path of your own, matched with its very own consequences. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> that show you that the choices you've made, Bear away. Chosen, could have gone another way. <laughs> That's really good, quarry, actually. There's no such yeah. thing as the wrong way. But be warned. <laughs> Come on now. Just... But that's a good point, though. We might actually have to worry about bears and falling rocks. Oh. Actually, yeah. That, that, that could be just a teaser of yeah. stuff you have to deal with. We swerved off, something jumped out. You got a preference? That's, uh... It looks like they're... Off. We swerved off. It looks like they're not timing me, either, which is interesting. Oh, I think... That's actually a better choice for because you know, like well, sometimes you're just, just like driving, what do I do? Yeah, it's really dark out here, and um, I don't know. We, we must have hit like a, a pothole or something. Cause you hit someone! I saw you hit someone. Now here we are. Also, I think it's a. Uh... I mean, these roads are really not in well, great shape. Oh, oh, okay. I got a little rumble yeah. for that. 
Why is there blood in his neck? Yeah, I noticed that before too, but they really sure. focus on it. Keep the car running. Sir? Is he gonna push is me? Is this kind of like the all time scariest car? No, the Texas Chainsaw There's Massacre stuff. remake cop was pretty <laughs> fucking scary. Yeah, <laughs> probably not. But I think like they took away the time option, maybe for streams, I guess. Yeah, he's pulling us. Because we were caught in mud, we're not getting out of that ourselves unless he pushed. Uh, this is going better than I thought, but I'm still nervous because it's a horror game. Hey, we we good now. Now you folks want to tell me just what in the hell you are doing all the way out here this late at night. Fair. I want to say we're heading to camp because we just are. There's like there's no reason to be dismissive. Friendly, because like, like we're heading up to Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. We're new counselors. You're one night early. No, no, we know. Um, but we figured we'd get in early and scope it out. You know, I mean, they know we're coming. We called ahead. And to be honest, sir, one of us kind of oversold their navigation skills and got us completely lost. <laughs> You're not going to make it to Haggett's Quarry. Not tonight. Harbinger Motel. It's the nearest place you can bunk up there for the night, okay? Uh, I think we're Harbinger, just going to that's really on the nose. I mean, <laughs> Mr. Hackett knows we're coming and we called ahead. No, ma'am, you're going to head to the Harbinger Motel. Do <laughs> Jesus. <you understand? laughs> Jeez. I will comply with Scary Man. Yeah, why not? Okay. I'm not fucking with this yeah, guy. We'll head to the motel. Understood. Uh, there's just one small problem. Uh, I forgot to spring for the middle of nowhere coverage plan on my phone. What he means is we're lost completely. All right, ma'am. Step out of the vehicle. Wait, what? This sucks. I just want to show you how to get to the motel. On your map there. Okay. That voice is vaguely familiar. Like, is this Ted Raimi? I could be way off base on this. Actually, remain in the vehicle. <laughs> this guy's so intimidating. Well, I think it could be him, actually. Kind of looks similar. It looks vaguely, yeah, a little bit. And he usually has, like, quick rolls in these things. I'm waiting for him to turn to our world, even though it makes no damn sense. Okay. So, we... Whatever. All right about here. Harbinger Motel is here. Right, okay, and where was Hackett's Quarry again? Well, I'm sure the fine folks at Harbinger <laughs> Motel can guide I love how, house. like... For he really room. is just playing it straight and just being like Mr. No Nonsense, but he comes off so scary. I know he does. <laughs> I love how this is such like a like a non scare situation, but he's just he's really just getting unsettling. Me. Yeah, <laughs> just really unsettling. Jesus, Harbinger Motel. Stay on the road. Watch out for potholes. Oh, you need like Have a statement? A good night. <laughs> Jesus! <laughs> this guy is terrifying. And he's just doing his job too this whole time. There's nothing like like scary, but he's just making it scary. He's just being really unsettling. <laughs> yeah. I guess if this is your job and you have teenagers in the middle of nowhere at night, like this is my big chance to Why be hard when we cop. Just He's waiting for us to go. I'm relieved. I always play nice guy. That guy was giving me major weirdo The dude needed like at least a dozen showers. Oh my god, I know. What was up with the thing? I Did you see was, that? Was it blood? Yeah, it clearly was. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Drive the car, dude. If it were me, I'd like, be immediately driving out of there. Alright, let's get back on the road. Yes. I think I've had enough woodland encounters for one night, thank you very much. Agreed. So where's this motel? Okay, so we're here, mm -hmm. and the motel is here. Okay. 
but we're going here. What's there? Hackett's Quarry. Are we going to go to the wrong place? I don't know. I kind of tricked him into showing up. <laughs> Very slick. Are you sure we shouldn't just get to the motel and just listen to this guy's advice? Honey, you really want to listen to the advice of some creep-ass cop who told us in the middle of the creep-ass woods to go to some creep-ass hotel? No, motel. That terrible. Let's hit the road, shall we? That's what I thought. Ma'am. There's a difference. Oh my god. If he called me ma'am one more time, I was going to shove that badge up his dick. Right? Do you so really want to troll this cop, though? I got like 20 years before I'm a ma'am. Mm hmm What? If he I, knows which way we're going. 20 is debatable. Easy. I mean, I'm kind of into ma'ams. Okay, we're done here. <laughs> Are we really going to make it to chapter one and not die? That'd be incredible. You know what? A part of me, like, I know we're not playing a third person game, but I was like, expecting the curator. I was like, oh, well, wait, wrong game. <laughs> well, I wonder if this game has a doctor or a curator. I really hope it does. Oh, baby, the summer camp of a horror movie. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. There's nobody here. We drive all the way the fuck We're still more. We could just die. Just look around before we jump to conclusions. Did you actually even talk to Mr. Hackett, or did you just leave a message? Well, what's the difference? This. This is the difference. <laughs> actually, you know, fair enough. Yeah. <laughs> Who checks their messages? I guess he doesn't check his voicemail. How was I supposed to know that? Do, do you check your voicemail? Yeah, no one checks their voicemail. You were supposed to know that when he gets back yeah, to you. Well, That's how you know that. This is a complete waste Why of would there be an abandoned? I'll take yeah. the car. Max, come on. Max, don't be but, a dick. I'm that sorry. cop just shows up. I told you to go. The motel is that way. <laughs> he's, like, oh. yeah, he's like he's behind the door. Did you not listen to me? I'm Miss Jack. <laughs> so there's the door. Obviously, I'll check it. Can I read that? It just says Hackett's Quarry. All right. Is knock, anybody knock. home? Who, where? It's like Silent Hill. You just hear a knock back. What? <laughs> if you push the handle hard enough, I think it'll open. <laughs> just push it really, really hard. And as we walk away, now we hear <laughs> from the other side. <laughs> Wait, there's a light on though? What the hell? Unless it's just a weird trick, trick of the light from out here? But that, no, that, it looks like there's a light on. And I'm not following Max, I'm just going this way now. Because who knows what we could find. Whoa, oh god. I'm gonna go back, not even because I'm spooked, but I cannot see a goddamn thing. Like, I don't even know if I can play the game at that point. And anything to the right? I don't think so. I, I can walk farther than I thought. And if I curve around, it's gonna get pitch black again, maybe? Or I cannot curve around? Maybe you can find a totem. You know, sign. Yeah, a totem normal. that indicates. I, I I'm very curious about the premonitions in this game because I mean, like you know, they're gonna be here. Or maybe they took it out. Who knows? Who knows? I mean, maybe they did, but like oh, that would be a the clue. A clue. What on the bottom? Yeah, see that? No, I don't. Go back. Uh, what, back up? Uh, no, no, no. no up, up the oh, yeah, okay, I see it. Sorry, I'm... Okay, I had to wait a couple steps. I was really thinking it was going to be like PS1 where you just have to sit and watch as you walk up all the steps. <laughs> it's like, really? It was the Resident Evil, but like... Yeah, Resident Evil 1. Do. Yeah, yeah. Do. Tree walk, fire pit, the cabins, tree house. Jetty, boathouse, Lodge. car park, car park. Really? This isn't England. Why do we call it car park? What doesn't kill you will make you stronger. Uh... <laughs> this is the harbinger. Or no, it's not. Doesn't that... kill you will make you stronger. By the way, considering this is eighty schlock, expect. There's no one here. Come on. Just give me one more minute, okay? I don't know if Max is the kind to do it. But we're gonna have our douchebag friends like grab us from behind for a scare early on, oh like like in Until Dawn. I know, it's just say like, haha, prank. With the musical sting, yeah, we got <laughs> you. We, we still think it's funny in twenty twenty two. Whoa, okay, it's just another car. Oh no, I saw a glow. I'm like, what the hell? Oh yeah, it's just the. Like, somebody's car. here. Isn't it your car? Well, okay, well yeah, that, that's your car right there. Then there's the other car.
it's not your car. It's someone else's car. I yeah. guess Mr. Hackett's car. It drives me crazy that there oh, appears to be someone. Go uh, underneath the. I guess. The what? Deck. Go in? Yeah, like yeah. under that goal, uh, yeah. glowing window? Okay. Uh, under the, I thought you said gulag. <laughs> under the. Yeah. <laughs> under the gulag? Where the fuckers in the gulag? God, it's dark. It was really. Oh. Oh. Is it knocking? Well, I heard the sound, but I didn't know if it was. Ooh. Maybe it was knocking. I thought it was ambient, but maybe not. What the fuck? Uh, could we not? Hey! Hey, are you okay? And scare in a second. I'll be right back. I'm gonna get some help. Yeah, just cut the eye cam, please. I don't like that. Especially in uh, super massive games. <laughs> I, oh my god. Max, get over here. What's going on? There's somebody in the bunker. I think they might be stuck. Stuck? But they didn't call back or not. I, I don't know. Just bring some tools so we can break the lock. Oh, we're dead. This oh, is you know this what? is how we die. Okay, I'm back. We're gonna get you out of there. I I, I think I think it's in there for a reason. What, what <laughs> I really just said tools. Well, I mean, usually it'd be some terrifying you? hostage situation, oh, but. There's someone in there. Mr. Hackett comes out. No, you mustn't open the bunker. I'm not seeing anyone. I don't look. I'm looking. I am. Let me see. It's not the fucking eye cam. I hate this. Oh, we're getting scared. There, there was definitely someone there. Okay, okay. So. Oh, do you have a preference for this? Because I don't know. I don't know. My brain says Oonga Boonga Hammer. Hammer? Yeah, if I, if I need to whack a dog boy in the face. I mean, a wrench is just as good at hammer whacking. Time. You sure? It's good. It looks hammer like, time. It looks like it takes either stick, by the way. Uh, yeah, okay, wrenches, I guess. Or urgent. So what? I'd, I'd rather not be urgent ever in these games, unless I'm in the middle of an escape QT, so I'll do indecisive. I don't know, but like maybe he can dodge a ball. I mean, so he can dodge a wrench. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. It works backwards. <laughs> but this is interesting, though. If the game pushes wrenches, maybe I should have stuck with the hammer. Who knows? We'll find out. That was easy, Damn. at least. I mean, those locks kind of suck. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right, here it comes. Here it comes. Yeah. As long as we're not doing eye cam. Get ready. So now is the time where... Wow. I guess we're doing this camera angle. Not even the camera angle, though. Hold hold on. Hold on. Um, It's not going to be camera. Display. Display. Yeah, brightness. What the fuck, man? I can't see a goddamn thing. You know what? I love it hard. It's like, okay, make sure this is not visible. Brightness on the max. <laughs> Every time. I can't see because of the white? No, I don't think I will. Oh, they're just directly mentioning Evil Dead? And they have a Raimi in the project. Oh, they do. <laughs> Ted Raimi was like one of the deadites in one of the movies. And he sweated so hard in that costume, he almost like passed hurt? out from heat exhaustion. Do you think the whole game is going to be just hey. expecting scares yeah. and it's just a basement? It's just a cop. Why the cop just be here? <laughs> There's no scares in this entire game. Whoop. Either the name's Ian, or there's, like, Brian or something. Uh, forward or left? Let's go left. Alright. Or I forward. forward it is. <laughs> <laughs> I have an idea, let's go forward. No, no, you just go left and then right. And then Can I just say, like, even though this is, like, a big building, this is some basement. It's like a <laughs> warehouse. Oop. Bloody collar. Again, with multiple question marks. This bloody collar looks to be too big for a dog. What kind of dog would be called Ian anyway? Oh, I think those like those are things like after you find out more about like uh, yeah, maybe so. Because like they, they did that in the older games, versus like you find out more and then like uh, more more data yeah. is unlocked. 
So what kind of dog is named Ian? Do you think we're doing a werewolf thing? Possibly. Like, this is my brand new dog named, like... Uh, I'm, I'm trying to think of some, like, unambiguously human name. Like, Ned is for, like, a horse, but, like... I don't know, like, um... C- Christopher. L- like, what? I wonder if there's, like, one of those, like, uh, hard ones with, like, the mad scientist crazy man person. Yeah. I don't know. I think this is such a weird thing to mention. I think there might have been a Mighty Max episode that it wasn't a dog person, but it was, like, a monster whose name was, like, Yuri. And Max is like, what? It's a weird name for what you are. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe we shouldn't have opened the door. <laughs> hmm. Max? Oh, uh, well. I guess it's not monster vision, it's just enemy vision. You could see normally, apparently. Oh. You should, but you should push your the bones. Are we really not going to look at the bones? I guess we already did, but not as a clue or anything. That looked fresh, too. That looked very fresh. Which means it's not hungry, and we're good to go. <laughs> Can you imagine the world's just like, Ugh, not now. It's like, I'm full. My tongue comes first. Here it comes. Hun, maybe it was a possum or something. No, there was, there was someone here. Are you somewhere. not going to talk about the skeleton? Hey, it's been kind of a night. You know? Which of them dies first? Let's just get to the motel. Yes. We can come back here first thing in the morning. We can check everything out, but... I mean, you must be exhausted. What I is the I zoom am. with the stairs? I think our imagination... Oh! Max? It was him! It was him! He died first. Max! Well, I guess he's the not-so-mighty Max. Wait, is he okay? Max! Unless he got slashed on the neck? His blood. Oh. Help. Oh, this sucks. So he got hit first. He might not die first. We might die first. I think I'm bleeding a lot. He got fucked up. So it doesn't just jump and eat him. Oh, I, I gotta help. Leaving guarantees he dies. Helping. Uh, you're not gonna punish me for it, but I might die. If this is the prologue, this might mean Max comes back way later in the game as NPC who helps. Because Laura's dead. It's prologue. We gotta die. Either that or Max is guaranteed dead, but where we find him will change. I want to see a face just come up the stairs real fast. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> really? Oh, is it the cop? Sure is. <laughs> Jesus. Does this look like the goddamn Harbinger Motel to you? Wow, he really was trying to get us out. I think that is Ted Raimi. It has to be. He looks to us like the... I'm just very uncomfortable that he drugged us, because now it's like, you know our secret. This is the royalty for the music? is not bad. Right? Oh, this has to be what you're right. This has to be what <laughs> Also, is this an anime? How big is that moon? What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, it's Final Fantasy XIV and Walker. <laughs> it's Inuyasha. <laughs> it's Final Fantasy IV. <laughs> Interesting opening. It's Majora's Mask. Do you think we have Mr. So? You've played the prologue. I guess we're about to find out. Uh. Oh my god, I think it is. Or, or, I, I, or I hope, maybe? Even though I know it's too oh. much to ask, I hope Peter Storm is inexplicably back. 
Hello, my friend. Oh, I, oh, Welcome hey. To the show. She was in the car. She was. Yeah, friend. Just like the curator shows up in game sometimes. So she's the freak I've show lady. I waited for you. I don't know. I've waited. Yes. So I help? do hope our time together proves enlightening. And do you think she's gonna fuck with us? There's no Ooh, she's to worry. <laughs> yeah. I'm here to help you. Well, it's like Peter Stormare was always going like out with his mouth. The unknown. It's oh, exciting. Yeah. Yes. And I don't know. Terrifying. But if you're brave enough, if you let me help you, the curator always showed up when we were on the verge of death. So her showing up, we might we have just crashed the car too. on that opening segment. You didn't and just ended the whole anything, thing. And so I've nothing to show you. You need to look. Wow, she's her. telling you to get more clues. If you don't help yeah, she is my fortune teller because the cards, tarot cards. We're supposed to be friends. I'm gonna endlessly That's talk about JoJo said. when we get these cards. <sighs> Only you can find them. Is that a JoJo reference? <laughs> I can't believe Tarot is referencing JoJo's Bizarre Adventure. <laughs> oh my god! Secrets and lies, paths to uncover, on which I can shed light if you let me. Help me help you. And remember, ah, what's it called? We'll make you stronger. Well, Max did not get stronger. He just died, I guess. Well, <laughs> that's the thing. What doesn't kill you? And he was killed. And now we get our big. Uh, He's not less stronger. Oh, He's just dead. That's right. Unless he comes back stronger. Oh, maybe he's not dead. <laughs> he fired a gun. He either killed that wolf or he killed Max or both. Chapter 1. Heck, it's Quarry Forever! Yes! What a pleasant place. <laughs> Where's Laura? Where's Max? No cancers. Oh. <laughs> it's a shame. I kind of like them. Yeah. There you go. And so... Oh, we, <laughs> sometimes games do this. We don't have a picture for the trophy, even though we should. 1953. So, Sam or Ted Raimi is, I guess, like grizzled, like creepy guy who only is that way because he's got this secret to keep. Yeah. I told you, kids, to stay away. Peace and love. See you later, kids. Yeah, hack it's quiet forever. <laughs> you know how many hearts are broken on the last day of summer camp? It's like a romance apocalypse. They'll get over it. You we'll never get, know. We'll get over it. I don't know. Alright. Yeah, well, I mean, they're just kids. You know, they'll get over it. Uh-huh. Like they'll get over Emma? Ooh. Huh? Jesus. It's not the same thing. Oh, so that's not why you're in a bad mood. I'm not in a bad... Oh, my. <laughs> you know what? We had our last night together, and we're cool. Oh, yeah. So cool that you're never going to see your special little boo-boo bear ever again. Jesus Christ. You heard that? <laughs> <laughs> Band-aids and rat turns. Okay, I get it. <laughs> Quit it. Hi, Emma. Hey. Okay, this is, um... You've heard of spatial awareness before, right? Yeah. Spatial awareness is for nerds. <laughs> uh, lean lamb and grab the last couple of bags, will you? Yes, boss. Say hi to Emma for me. You're a bad person. Yes, I am. <laughs> and we're playing. What is our name? Jacob. Okay, I re oh there it is. It's, it's the menu itself. I, I was waiting for it to show up by his face or something. All right, camp paths. Let's take ourselves a look real quick. Laura and Max above the law. Oh, what? Travis is above the law. A video nasty. Again, car park. Like that's like a British thing instead of garage. Video nasty. Like, I never heard of that until, like, Red Letter Media, but that was a big thing in the 80s in, I don't know if it was England specifically, or the UK in general, but that was when there was a huge backlash about, like, grindhouse, like, schlock, gore stuff, oh, and, yeah. like, they were called video nasties, and like, people came down hard on, on censorship and banning certain movies. You'll never take me alive. A shot in the dark could come back to haunt you. With a long arm of the law ever extending, whether it holds a gun or an olive branch at the end, it is up to you. Does the, it even says on the case? That's great. Does this look like the goddamn Harbinger Motel? That's awesome for a dollar. 
please rewind. Oh man, I love this. <laughs> I love this. Do I have to like select it for the exclamation to go away? Oh, Laura lied to the cop. Interesting. Oh, so that shows us the path. Tried to help. Wow. How much a relationship can endure. Love at first fright. An Amory Bajwa film? Max Brinley, Laura Kearney. I wonder if those are references. And these are all video nasties, I guess. This is this is great. Uh camp. Camp cabins. Campers bunk there, helpful counselors. There's a tree in the middle of the cabins that symbolizes the growth of the campers. Oh my god, that's such a tacky thing that you just say to kids. <sighs> Makes me think of Adam's family too. Where they're all like, uh huh. Well, actually, that's not true. They were all into it. Wednesday was like, uh huh. <laughs> all right, so it looks like we've gotten our spooky, scary video nasties, but for now, it is time to stop the installment. 